hello friends welcome to my channel again uh, i was not sure what should be the heading of this video whether it should be reducible difficult or logged and dear shoulder dislocation so i just named it reducible and dear shoulder so this patient presented to me in casualty 27 year old male laboral sit and fall while carrying a heavy load over his head and developed anterior dislocation of shoulder almost subglenar type and i tried reducing it with the alprakash method i failed three times and then i tried the my previous method before i started doing alprakash method the traction counter traction method no i am not pulling it toward the ceiling and this the video is rotated like that and you can see that the with the sheet we are giving the counter traction and with my elbows locked in full extension i am giving in the traction and the purpose of this maneuver is to fatigue the muscles mainly the subscapularis which prevents the shoulder reduction and after the subscapularis gets fatigued the shoulder will reduce automatically after failing with the alprakash method i had asked the patient like uh, how did they reduce your dislocation the first time and he told me that they took him to ot and gave him anesthesia and that's how the sh shoulder was reduced so i had prepared myself for that scenario again so but i think i thought that i should give my last try with the traction counter traction method and now i will fast forward the video from here uh, i had also given one intraarticular injection so that the shoulder is not painful and you can see that the pain is not that much and i got tired at this point and switched hands with another fellow and again i will fast forward the video so after around 5 minutes i thought the subscapularis would be adequately relaxed so i tried pushing it back into position so i was skeptical here that if it is not reduced or not because previously to i had heard uh, two clunks but they were subtle so i again checked it at the last time here i thought that the head is reduced now so i thought of getting check x-ray now and then you can see that the head is reduced and you can also see the heel sex lesion in this x-ray and as the patient is a laborer and only only 27 year old male so i advised him a target procedure to prevent recurrent shoulder dislocation and i think you have, would have got the answer to your question like which is better counter traction or uh, the alprakash method I think Alprakash method would be the initial choice, but if it is not reduced by that method, you can try the other methods, whatever you are familiar with. But counter traction, traction, counter traction works for me. Thank you.